So this is called TTC stain. Uh, guys, do you know that every closed tissue, when the membranes are intact, have LDH enzyme inside, okay? This is the main dye which we use. And you know, uh, the uh, so normally the cell membranes are intact and it has LDH inside it. So this dye goes inside the heart and you know, stain that LDH and gives a brick red color. That's the color that gets to the normal uh, live uh, cells. But suppose if the cell is dead, that is irreversible damage has occurred, what is going to happen is the membranes are going to get open and this enzyme LDH will leak out. So because this enzyme will leak out, so what is going to happen? So TTC will go inside, but there is no LDH now. So it will not stain anything. So that area will appear pale. Okay. okay. So let me show you an image of it. Okay. So this is the section of the heart, just like I told you, bread loafing. Okay. So I hope everybody understood what I told, bread loafing okay that's, slicing the bread yes slicing the bread right so if you look at this can you see this this is a ttc stain okay triphenyl tetrazoleum chloride okay and if you look at this this part is brick red in color this is normal viable heart but can everybody look at this part okay so this part of the heart is not stained this ttc part, Yes, TTC. That's TTC. the that is better, like JP. <laughs> <laughs> yes. So okay. this part is not stained. So that means this part is infected heart. So I, I hope everybody can see this. Now, can you see these, sir? Uh, these glistening white areas. You know what is this glistening white area? Glistening white. Normally we say fibrosis or yeah, something like. Yeah, perfect. Whenever there's an old scars, okay. So, whenever there is an old scar that gets glistening white area. So, if you wherever we find that glistening white areas, we know that probably this patient has already got an infarct and it has undergone.